So we, we've noticed some influence we've had on, uh, on other sites. Uh, one, one positive influence is a lack of, uh, uh, we, people were um, overly focused on page views, and, or at least the wrong kind of page views, where slideshows and paginating long articles um, just so that they could get extra impressions. And we took a very strong stance against that early on, and we made these long scrollable lists instead of slideshows, and we never broke our longer articles down into five pages just to get more, more ad impressions. And it just was so much better for consumers. And what we saw was a lot of other sites followed suit, and the New York Times, the Washington Post, other, other publications started to, to not paginate their articles, to make them more friendly for mobile where you could scroll for a long time, where you don't have to click a little next page button. Um, so that's a positive influence. I think we've also seen some, some companies see what BuzzFeed's doing and see the success we're having and then, and then try to copy it and do kind of second-rate BuzzFeed content. And that's one uh, influence where you know, it's, it's an unfortunate influence because you know, we, we are trying to take where, what we're doing and always make it a little bit better, a little bit better, and, and grow, grow and improve and get better every single day. And then when people see what we're doing and copy it, what we're doing today, they're kind of missing you know, where we're headed and, the, and, and that can have a negative impact on the, on the web. A lot of the things we do are harder than it looks. You know? So people think, oh, journalism's really hard, but you know, a collection of cute kittens must be really easy. Anyone could do that. Um, but actually, there's more competition to make a, the definitive collection of cute kittens than there is to, to do most journalism. You know? So um, making great entertaining content is really hard. And people look at Hollywood and they realize, oh, it's hard to make a, a, a blockbuster movie. Um, but when, with the web, people still don't take it seriously enough. Where The web is really where culture is. And that's the most uh, important, exciting part of, of, of the media industry right now is digital video, social, and mobile. And, that's actually as hard as making a feature film. It takes a deep understanding of lots of different things about the ecosystem and the content and human psychology and you know all the the subject matter and and so um, people you know people should realize this stuff is actually harder than it looks. Yeah. So our approach was never to do, to do one specific thing. Our our the focus of our company is to really understand in a deep way the social web and how it's changing and how it's evolving, and then to make media for the way people consume it today, which is you know, Facebook and Twitter and WhatsApp and Line and.